Hello everyone, this is Rick and thanks for joining. This is the third PowerPoint 2007 tutorial. And in the second tutorial, I showed you how to make a real basic PowerPoint presentation using a template. What I'm going to do here is I'm going to show you how to make a PowerPoint presentation from scratch. So what you do is go File New and you just use the blank presentation and you can see here's a little outline here. And So I'm going to go ahead and just type in uh, See, 10 minute train and then subtitle I'm going to just label it computer based video training computer based video training okay then to add a new slide you can either there's several ways to do it right and click right here you can right click here and say new slide or you could do control M as in Mary and it'll add a new slide and you can see it laid out a format for you for a title and then um, options to add text or insert you know tables charts pictures whatever so I'm gonna go ahead and go ahead and just label this one Excel 2007 training and then I'm gonna go ahead and put in here um, now I'll just do intro to Excel, Excel basic spreadsheets, and I'm going to say Excel advanced features. All right, and now if I go up here and I hit the increase list level over here, you'll notice it changes to a hyphen there, and I will do pivot tables, um, let's see, financial, um, formulas, macros, and we'll say B lookups. And then we want to add another slide, and we're going to go ahead and do Control M, and we're going to go over here, and we're going to say uh, I don't know, PowerPoint two thousand and seven training. I'll just say okay, and we'll just say Intro to PowerPoint, and we're going to go ahead and leave everything off. We'll just make it uh, keep to keep it short. I'm not going to keep expanding on this. So. So now this is a really basic, you probably wouldn't really be showing this to too many people. White background, black font, doesn't really look very impressive. Of course we haven't done anything to it yet. So what you could do is go into view, option under the ribbon here, go to slide master, and you'll see there's lots of different um, ways you can edit this. So we could go over here and we could say uh, rather than um, the black font we could click it and do yeah let's make it red font okay and then we could go over here under the main um, text under the first bullet here and we could make this uh, sorry uh, we could make it I didn't mean to do that let me hit undo we could make it um, green font so let's do that now let's make it uh, blue font up blue font okay and we'll leave these other ones off for right now um, you can go down here and put in a footer and make it 10 minute train right and sort of corporate logo or whatever um, now you know you're looking at this and you say Jesus really doesn't uh, still doesn't look very impressive let's uh, go ahead and close out of here view normal mode and now you know you've added a little something to it so it's getting a little bit better but let's say you want to go ahead and um, let's go to slide master again and we want, eh, let's go ahead and click here and we're gonna just uh, right click click on the corner of the slide here anywhere in this open area here and say format background right click and go down and choose format background with your left mouse button and let's just do the fill for right now, solid fill, and let's make it, uh, let's go ahead and make it green. Then we can say apply to all, close, let's go back to view and say normal. And now 
you know you notice would have to change this font right to be a different color so you could see it better right uh, so let's assume that this were fixed up a lot more than it is we would go over here and one thing we could do if we wanted to make this our template now we can make our own template and we'd say file save as and we'll go over here and instead of a PowerPoint presentation would go over here and we would say PowerPoint template save it in there and and now if I exit out of here let me close it and now if I were coming in from scratch and I wanted to create a new presentation from that template I could go down to under templates go to my templates and there it is 10 minute train okay and so now you see that I have my base my template all set up it's saved and we can edit it and save the template keep in mind you save a presentation you're saving the presentation if you save a template you're saving that that template as a format that you can reuse so thanks for joining uh, please uh, subscribe if you um, uh, hopefully you're getting some good use out of these and let me know what you want to see and we're going to come back with lots more um, get more advanced here right animation inserting objects things of that nature so thanks for joining